Dunfermline have won more games on the road than at East End Park and they were looking to take advantage of United's cup hangover. So early on they had claims for a penalty turned down when Harry Curran's shot was handled by Perry. Will a young wave play on and during the melee, Morris Malpass took a knock, an elbow in the head causing him to have concussion and Seep Dijkstra frustrated by the referee's delay in bringing on the physio. Malpass in clear pain there and he had to go off minutes later the end of the game for him. Another controversial incident coming up. French sends in the corner. Bingham towers for the header and appears to be elbowed by Ziggy Johnson. The referee again looks away as Andy Smith has the best chance of the match to score. But a good save by Dijkstra. United were desperate to hit the back of the net, but they were lacking the usual cavalier approach. The shot from Shell Olofsson, no power in that left foot drive and well saved by Westwater. It was a game of wasted chances. This perfect build-up by Peterson, Perry's precision cross, and Olofsson in the right place to finish, but still nil-nil. Peterson looks sharp again with this cross, picking out Winters, who was denied by an alert Westwater. United were determined to finish as winners, and Andy McLaren's surging run and shot forced Westwater to pull off the save of the match. Then came Dunfermline's chance to wrap things up. Smith beats his marker, but Easton's enforced pass back wins the pars a free kick. Protests from the Dundee United defence to referee Willie Young, but this could be the chance for Dunfermline to take all three points. Andy Smith desperate to get on with things, but United still delaying the action. Willie Young placing the ball, and Craig Easton still frustrated. Greg Shields free kick touched away by Dijkstra and in the end wasted chances and a dull affair. A dull affair. Well, this is how the Premier Division looks tonight after today's game. Hearts still lead the way. They're in 36 points. Rangers, thanks to Marco Negri, beat Hibbs by one goal to nil this afternoon here at Ibrooks, and they chase a point behind. Celtic on 29.